as we forgive our indebtedness, there is no iniquity in Jesus Christ. The iniquity is in you and I. Again, welcome to House of Russian Gospel, Blog Talk Radio. Gospel music today, Ken and Jean Grady. Enjoy. This is Gospel Music Today. Now, here are the hosts of Gospel Music Today, Ken and Jean Grady. We are glad you could spend some time with us on Gospel Music Today. We have Southern Gospel News coming up, some concert updates, and Jean has a feature group. All the way from California, it's Evidence Quartet. From the National... This is Gospel Music Today. Now, here are the hosts of Gospel Music Today. Ken and Jean Grady. We are glad you could spend some time with us on Gospel Music Today. We have Southern Gospel News coming up, some concert updates, and Jean has a feature group. Our feature group this week is the Keith Barkley Ministries. From the National Quartet Convention, I will be talking to Jonathan and Jordan. That's Wilburn and Wilburn on today's program. And you've been listening to some new music. A new CD by Sacred Harmony. And you've been reading. I've been out reading Singing News Magazine. We were at a concert in Marietta, Georgia. We heard the King's Heralds sing. And we will have exclusive concert video on today's program. And just where in this country are we going to the archives? From a few years ago in Broken Arrow, Oklahoma, we heard the Ambassadors. We will have exclusive video on today's show. There's a lot going on. Let's get started. You are watching Gospel music today the news is next stowtown records is releasing a compilation project with some of silver dollar city's favorite artists to celebrate the park's diamond jubilee the collingsworth family has teamed up with an organization called renew a nation to work on giving children and grandchildren a biblical worldview the Gatlin brothers are working with Time Life Records to bring many of their previously unavailable recordings on digital platform to Spotify and other streaming services. Mainstream music and entertainment has added poet voices. Phil Cross started the group in the early 1990s, and poet voices now includes Phil Cross, Donny Henderson, Nick Holland, and Kyle Cornish. They are currently working on new music and videos. That's a look at some of the happenings in the world of Southern Gospel. You can keep up with the latest Southern Gospel news by reading SGN Scoops Digital Magazine. Take a look at their website at sgnscoops.com. And you can find more Southern Gospel news at our website, gospelmusictoday.com. We have been on the road. Yes, we have. We've been to Marietta, Georgia, and we always love the drive down to there. We were able to hear the King's Herald sing, and I believe you have a clip. Yes, we do.
Heralds were our booth neighbors for the years when the National Quartet Convention was in Louisville, and we always enjoy seeing them, and we always enjoy that great concert series that Robert York promotes in Marietta, Georgia. It's always a great time. Who has a birthday this week? Happy birthday to Austin Wisnan. Austin sings with his family in the Wisnans, and his birthday is June 12th. And we wish a happy birthday to all our Southern Gospel friends. We have more singing from the King's Heralds coming up on today's program. But first, Jean has been listening to some new music. Believe is a new CD by Sacred Harmony. It was produced by Les Butler and has some great songs by some of the most well-known Southern Gospel songwriters. It opens with Up to Something and also has Grave Robber. Barry the Workman also features the Fairfield Four. My favorite is Mary's Hands. That's Believe by Sacred Harmony. This is a concert update from Gospel Music Today. Legacy 5 will be at Elizabeth Baptist Church in Marietta, Georgia on June 20. If you're looking for a concert near you, check the search engine at gospelgigs.com. And you can always use the links at our website, gospelmusictoday.com. In 1981, Keith Barkley started traveling with his family, playing and singing. And later in 1996, he was licensed to preach. In February of 2000, he met his wife, Tabitha, from Crowley, Louisiana, and they were married in August of that year and then completed their first album in November. Tanner Barkley was born in 2002, and in 2003, the family formed their own ministry. Over the years, Keith Barkley and family tradition has served at concerts, camp meetings, and Bible conferences. For more information about this week's feature group, go to KeithBarkleyMinistries.com. We had our Gospel Music Today cameras on the road in Marietta, Georgia. We heard the King's Heralds sing, and that exclusive video is up next on Gospel Music Today. Time to get out your wings. Time to fly. Down deep in my soul. Down deep in my soul.
wonderful time. Oh, what a 